Mic check one, two, two, check one, three. Live and prompt to uh, watch along of AEW Forbidden Door with uh, the idiot homie E007. I meant to put I meant to put two idiots watch watch along on the on the marquee, but that's what it is, y'all. We checking out the bed door tonight. This is pretty much halfway through um, the joint, halfway through the pay per view. Uh, just got finished watching the um, the four way with Adam Cole. Uh, Okada, uh, Switchblade, and who was the fourth person? The Cowboys. Oh, uh, Hangman Adam Page. And uh, Switchblade won. I uh, predicted that E007 was wrong. He was saying was Okada upset. was going with. He was saying Okada was going to win. No, I didn't. I said if they, take, if they don't let him keep the belt, they're going to give it to Okada. I said if they don't take the belt off of Switchblade, they're going to give it to Okada. That's he what I said. He's going to say y'all that. Y'all see how you twist my words. So y'all rewind this part and watch how you twist my words around. Of course, he's going to say that afterwards. But so I far, so good. It's been a good pay-per-view. It's been a good pay-per-view. We still got some um, matches coming up. This is kind of impromptu. Um, checking in with you guys. It's been um, hey, show him our sponsor. Crazy so far. He, he want me to show a vodka bottle. I'm not gonna show a vodka bottle. <laughs> but it, but it, it definitely is a sponsor tonight. <laughs> I'm it's saying, absolute man. It's, it's absolute. Shout abs- out to absolute. Shout out to absolute vodka. You might get them to be a sponsor of the show one day. There you go, absolute vodka. <laughs> Shout out to y'all tonight. Y'all holding us down. Yeah man. I think I guess it's main event time. Yeah, they about to put it on right now. Yeah. Who's gonna win the belt? I I think I think uh, Moxley's gonna win it, but it would be cool if Tanahashi won it. And, and then he went to Japan and won it back. Exactly. Yeah. And, and, and 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 you know, depending upon how long CM Punk gonna be out. You yeah. go to Japan, win it back in Japan, and then come back. Yeah. But at the same time, you can't go wrong with CM Punk versus Moxley. So I mean, but you can't go wrong with putting CM Punk in Japan. I don't think you can. Uh, I think that would be. I think that the Japanese <clears throat> fans would stop being silent. Yeah, possibly, but I, I, I think at the same time too. Depend upon how long CM Punk gonna be out. You don't want your belt to be in Japan that long. So who's gonna win this match? I'm gonna go with Moxley. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty much going with Moxley. Oh, you got you got William, got Regal, William Regal coming out with him. I I told you before, Moxley has Eclipse. Dean Ambrose. Moxley is a new man. He is like the new version. Of Let's see. Dean Ambrose, U.S. United States champion. Oh, come on, man. World heavyweight champion. I'm not taking that stuff away, but this Tag guy, team this champion. guy right here, Tag Team champion. He can't lace his boots, really. To be honest, are with you, you kidding me? Come on. As far as we talking championships, those, those, those are. Dude. Look, how many championships he won in, in AEW? Just that he how many championships he's won the he won AEW championship. He won the IWGP uh, championship. I'm talking about he's won the GC. In AEW, he's won the a, the uh, AEW World Heavyweight Championship. He's won the IWGP US Championship. He's won the GWC Championship. When does he have the tag These team These are from belt? different companies. When does he have the tag team belt? Oh, he failed at that. Nah, yeah, they, he him and that. Diane Bryan he ain't went for the tag that. team championship yet. But if they that. go for the, when they come for the six, um, and they, they, they the have the trio championship, 
they'll probably win that. I'm just saying, I'm not taking anything away from Dean Ambrose accolades in WWE. I'm just saying, this guy, this guy right here, if he ever make his way back to WWE, I guarantee it's John Moxley. He, it'll never be Dean Ambrose again. Because this guy is a different guy. I mean, you can switch subjects because I agree with you on that. This I is a different guy. That, that. I mean, that, that, that's all I'm saying. No, I agree with you this on that. This is a different guy right here. But the whole thing is, is that, my thing is, is that he's still on a, a fast track to... to what, what do y'all think? He's on a fast track to surpass comment, Dean Ambrose. Com- make you comment. If Dean Ambrose is... If John Moxley Hear has basically out. eclipsed Dean Ambrose, comment in the comment section. Out. That's all out. I'm saying. Hear me out. He's on a fast track to eclipse Dean Ambrose. And he, he, got fa- that he has eclipsed he Dean got, Ambrose. He got that yet. John Moxley has eclipsed Dean Ambrose. Do, buddy. John Moxley did some stuff with. I'm not taking away the, the, the whole do, thing, deal with the shield. But he yeah, is definitely the John shield, Moxley. the shield is, the destruction they call. The on, shield man. was the shield. But John, on, but on, on a, on, on a single tip, he's not talking to plants. He's not talking to Mitch the plants. He put the Undertaker through the fucking announce table. Dude. Shield. He'll t- John Moxley will tell you he's that this run right Moxley. here Listen. is his best run. Listen. Tanahashi. But Tanahashi's coming thing, out right is, now. My thing is this. The stars that Listen Dean Ambrose idiot. has been up against ain't matching what's in here. And he's having a harder time than he had with The Undertaker in here. So come on, man. Stop it. He, he's having, he had a match with, what's the dude's name from the uh, Jericho Appreciation Society? Uh, Jake, Jake Hager. No, the little dude. What's his name? You got a Spanish name, though. You look like a white oh, man. Oh, uh, uh, Daniel Garcia. Garcia. Yeah. Took him to the limits. Daniel, Daniel Garcia's good. He took Dean Ambrose, he, he took uh, John Moxley to the limits. But Dean Ambrose took Undertaker to the limits. You can't tell me that he surpassed Dean Ambrose yet, yo. You can't tell me that. Who, who bigger, it's actually who bigger two, in the rings two has he been in with? Ask yourself that question. Who bigger than the Undertaker that he's he's been been going in the the ring with? He's been in the ring with some of the biggest stars in AEW. Who bigger than the Undertaker? And in New Japan. Who bigger than the Undertaker? I mean, I'm just saying. Who bigger than the Undertaker? Like, you know, you can use use the Undertaker, but it's not a lot of people that's bigger than the Undertaker. He hated when I make sense. He hated it. The match is about to start. Yes. I just want to make sense. Sometimes he don't make sense. He got on red, white, and blue too. Look like a damn uh, Power Ranger. A lot of people was com- no, we're not saying. I, I won't say complaining, but a lot of people was um, saying he wasn't that good in the ring on. Uh, yeah, he been on slipping Dynamite. a little bit. Yeah, no, 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 not John Moxley, but Tanahashi. That's what I'm talking about. Like he's been a little, a little clunky. To say the least. Well, to be honest, I haven't I'd seen I'd like him. to see him in the match because it looked like good intention, it looked like good ideas, but his his sling blade is clunky. He did it twice. He, he did it twice and it was clunky. It was real clunky. Yeah, I, I, I hadn't seen a lot but of But it might be because he didn't have a wrestling clothes on, so his match is going to tell us a lot. Well, I mean, a lot of people say that, like, that you know, the Japanese style is a little different, too. But I haven't seen a lot of his matches, so I can't say well. So far, these He's Japanese the guys have been great. But, they, you know, they say this guy with Tanahashi is, is an older cat. You know what I'm saying? He's older and he's wrestling like he's older. Since yeah. Up to this match. Up yeah, that, this that's, match. That, and that's what I heard. His dynamite yeah, he, he's appearance. He's definitely was. been wrestling older. Like, he's, he's lost a step if he's as great as everybody's saying. He was, he's lost a step. Yeah. I guess still cool to see him. You know, I've never seen him wrestle before. We had a 10 minute, minute mark, y'all. Just want to check in a little bit. I, you know, I don't know if we're going to go through this whole match. 
I'm sure a lot of you are, uh, are checking out the pay-per-view right now. Uh, yeah, uh, like me and my buddy are doing right now. Like I said, it's been a pr pretty good show so, uh, so far, so I'll ch keep checking it out. We're in the main event. John Moxley versus Tanahashi. Yeah. And you are now in the mix of Jack in a Box. Yeah. <laughs> that too. <laughs> you are tuned in to Jack in a Box. Or is it Jack in the Box live? I, that's just what I got on the marquee. Yeah, that's what I read. Makes the most of every opportunity he's got. Oh my God! Man, good show so far, though, y'all. Let's talk about how good the production is looking right now, though. The, the production is looking great. Yeah, man. I mean, it's, it's, it's you know, I, I think. With them being in the United Center, it's important you want to show that crowd. It's a big crowd. It's supposed Look to be a sellout crowd. crowd. That, that crowd. Talk about the crowd, Jack. And, and you, you want to make sure you you show that that how many people in the, they they got get they got it lit up right. You know but what I mean? You, you remember when that Japanese guy came out earlier and how they popped for him? What was that guy's name? Which one the you guy came about? out and saved Orange Cassidy. Y'all gotta go back and watch that. The crowd went nuts for him. The guy um, who's Orange Cassidy put sunglasses on. I don't, I don't know. I don't remember his name. Yeah. They, but they did. He, they did pop for him. He, they popped big time yeah, for him. Yeah. They did. They did pop for him. So apparently he was some some type of surprise or something. But yeah, they whoever it is, the Japanese wrestling fans. Well, not American even just the, that, that's what I was about, about to say. Guys. Yeah, the, the Americans. That's. It's mostly American fans in the building. Yeah, so. you said it was about five percent. Maybe came over from Japan. Yeah, yeah, I, I would, that would be my my guess. Maybe about five. I guess to five percent, maybe five to ten percent, maybe you know. Um, but they, they it, it is a sellout crowd. So, uh, and it looked like it when you're looking at it. Uh, we're checking it out on uh, the homie's laptop right now. Um, but yeah, we another thing we, we mentioned was they are using the LED rampway tonight. Yeah. And that should be a regular staple on Dynamite and Rampage. It should be longer too. Yeah, just but a I, bit. I, I, just I'm, a bit. I'm I'm cool. I'm happy with it, but it should be just a little bit longer. Yeah, I got I mean if, if I had it my way it would go all the way to the ring. But I probably would stop it right before. I would have an area right before the ring like this. I get it. I get it. You know it. what I'm saying? But just, but just but even, same, same optics. Right, right. But even that, even that touch of them using. I mean, I and I, I have seen them use it like on pay per views before. But I would like to see them use it like on regular dynamites and rampage and just like you said earlier, maybe even do something else. Maybe even to spruce up the dynamite and the rampage. Uh, sets because they've been using them now for like three years, and get at least the dynamite one anyway. So, but it's good to see it on the pay per view. How would you say the crowd is right now for this championship match? Because I feel like they're acting like Japanese fans right now. They tired. Shit, they tired. It's the, <laughs> it's, it's the end of the night. It's, they they've been popping all night with all these matches. Mm -hmm. So. What's left in them? <laughs> They're going to have to bring it out of them. I mean, Box would be good for it. If uh, Tanahashi still got whatever everybody say he has. I feel like this is the most underwhelming uh, championship match in a long time. Like the the build up wasn't it wasn't long enough. I think it wasn't. They didn't get into this enough for me. Well, to be fair, this is supposed to have been CM Punk versus Tanahashi. Yeah. So they had to pivot 
and do the tournament so um, John Moxley could come in and take his place. And so far, this run of CM Punk has limited his UFC career. Not fair. It is. It's not it, fair. It, 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 it's, it's limited. He got it. I mean, dude, he. It's he, underwhelming. To it me. wasn't even a run. He won the belt, and then the next night, he. The next week, he broke his foot by jumping in the crowd being an idiot. <laughs> there you go. So I mean, that just not, makes me right, right there. You called him uh, an idiot, and you know, I was calling him an idiot in a different way. Nah, nah. Yeah, you nah, called him an idiot. You agreed nah. with me. You didn't no, even I mean, know. I'm just saying that doesn't <laughs> mimic his UFC career. You gotta. But like, I think that nobody cares. You gotta if, fall off a bike. Uh, I think nobody cares if John Moxley wins because they already kind of know he's gonna win. Like the big thing would be is. Kind of how she won. I that agree was, that with you. I, to me, that would be different. That, that would, would be set very the whole different. wrestling world on fire. They got to do it. Also, um, a match between CM Punk and John Moxley could set it on fire too. So again, it's a win-win, and I think they're gonna go for I mean, the easy win. We're talking hypothetical matches versus real matches. What do you mean? You you the, 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 the Tanahashi and ta, the Tanahashi winning the belt is very hypothetical. I'm talking about dealing with what's going on right now, not hypothetical CM Punk. I'm talking about if, this if John Moxley wins, it's gonna be yay. If Tani Hashi wins, it's gonna be like, oh shit! I'm sorry. Who is Tani Hashi? Huh? Tani Hashi? You said Tani Hashi. Tani Hashi, whoever his name is, man. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm just saying. Either way it go, either way it go, it's it's a it's a win win. To me, I, I agree with you. If Tani Hashi wins and he goes back to uh, New Japan with the belt. That would be really cool. But if John Moxley wins and we're Nobody's sure. Gonna care. It's going to be crickets. I don't agree with that. It's going to be crickets. It's going to be crickets. Give me the crickets. They're going to have to build something. They're going to have to build something. With, with, with Tyler Hashi winning, the play is set. It's already in the motion. You know, with him winning. And then I don't, and I want I want Moxie to be champ, but I don't want his second turn to be done this way. Cause he's like one of those wrestlers that you, you like to see him chase it. You know what I mean? You like to see him chase that belt. Come on, don't front. Dude, I'm not I'm not disagreeing with you. I'm just saying I just I just think um I don't want to for the most like part this. it's set up to be a good deal either way. They just have to do either way. They have to just book it right. I don't want them to win it like this. We have to see. Hopefully. I want to hope. I want to hope. Tani Hashi. Tani Hashi just got put to a table. Yes, he did. With a rock bottom. Yeah, with a rock bottom. Uh, Moxley just put it to the table with a rock bottom. Back in the ring like Even what? though he's uh, compared to Stone Cold often. On the replay. Oh, Damn, he took that good. Oh, Steve. Oh, That's all the replays. What were the replays earlier during the, the oh, off screen no. match? Yeah. You, there were some things that happened in that off screen. Off uh, screen, yeah. Uh, yeah. What's his name? Yeah. OJ Simpson, what's his name? <laughs> It's Orange Cassidy. <laughs> yeah. He called Orange Cassidy OJ Simpson. <laughs> I was just saying, like, that was a hell of a move for move match. That's it was. Cool. And, and, and it actually. With no replays. Actually, so far, the match of the night. But I was pointing out that they didn't do no, replays. No, I had replays. Right, they right doing replays that. for this, though. And they're doing replays for this. It doesn't make sense. It's almost like the replay guy been sleep. And they woke him up. And <laughs> or he went in and get hot dogs. And came in. <laughs> like, damn. Yeah, the matches, the, the, I mean, well, the crowd is a lot more subdued 
than they've been all night. I think they're tired. Where's William Regal at? A lot of times he goes straight to the uh, commentary room. No, but I haven't heard him or seen him around the ring. I don't know. It's, you know, they have a six man uh, booth. He might be talking. I'm rooting for Tanahashi because Moxley can afford to win. He can afford he can afford to lose. And I think it would be really cool for Tanahashi to take the belt back to New Japan and Mox and CM Punk goes back to New Japan and beat him beat him for the belt. That would be cool. What do you guys think? Like is sucks. sucks. He is time out to sling blade. Sucks. They know Maybe it, at one it. point it was good. Maybe he just kind of. It sucks. Out. That was the worst one yet. Shit. I missed it. And now he's bloody. Oh, oh. Come on, man. I don't know. You you said it wasn't good, but it it cut him open. Trust me. Take this part back. And he, he doesn't. None of this shit makes sense right now. Like, he just wanted to bleed. Like, hit your head on something and then bleed. He did a sling blade and it made you bleed. Maybe he scratched him. Oh, shit. That was uh, pretty uh, stiff. <laughs> that was some motherfucking stiff ass jump, guys. Oh. He was stiff. Oh. Look how stiff that was. Yeah. Hard to hold back your weight when it's in the air. Oh my goodness! Uh, it, it's not. I'm not big. I'm not buying it. Uh, Moxley is now busted. busted. Wide open from a bunk ass sling blade. Yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah. How you bust somebody open with a bunk ass sling blade? You never seen nobody get busted up on a sling yeah, blade. Tanahashi got the worst sling blade in the game. Maybe Tanahashi cut him with his nails or something. I don't know. Got the worst sling blade in the, in the game. <laughs> worst so. sling blade in the game. Yes. That's weird. You think about it, blood burning in your eyes. You know, Mox is gonna win. He bleeding too. First one to bleed wins. Trying to make it to the rest of the bit, the, the match, but I may clip it for a second. This is just a quick video, just kind of checking in for everybody that's checking out um, Forbidden Door right now, AEW Forbidden Door, live on pay per view. Or if you got a, uh, a site, you can check it out and for free, like we're doing right now. <laughs> Oh, this is Netflix. Tanahashi record. Uh oh, recording made something. Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm gonna check out. It's giving me some kind of message. I'm gonna check out and check back in with you guys. Like, share, and subscribe. And Hit that notification button as well yeah. because you're in tune right now, broadcasting live. Jack in the box, yeah. live. You heard him. I'll let y'all check back in. <laughs>